Hello, uh, this is a video of a bike ride along the River Cam. I'm starting here in uh, Chesterton. There's my view at the very start of it. And, um, well, I'm going to shoot various videos as I head along and reach various points of interest until I reach um, Bates Bite Lock, where this uh, video will end. So we're now underneath the railway bridge Well there's always a lot of um, street art around here I often do this bike ride at least once or twice a year and the street art is always changing Ooh, This one's in very shiny silver paint and there's plenty to show you on the other side there and the river is reflecting up at this bridge so if I just walk through and show you what the bridge looks like and as I stand here off to that direction is Cambridge North Station that's not too far away and about five minutes by train in that direction is Cambridge Station now all this activity that's going on here with diggers and people in high-vis and what have you they're building a footbridge that will form part of a um, pedestrian and cycle network across Cambridge and that will fit by the looks of things somewhere around here but yeah, since there's all fences up and lots of work going on uh, get out of people's way that's uh the next video will come from somewhere a bit quieter sign for what they're building here, it's called the Chisholm Trail including the Abbey to Chesterton Bridge of the map. There's a map down here showing how it will go across Cambridge from Cambridge North Station to Cambridge Railway Station to the south of the city centre and the Addenbrooke's Hospital and the Biomedical Campus. distance that is the chimney of the Cambridge Museum of Technology which is a former Victorian pumping station and if I slowly go in this direction that is the tower of Fenditton Parish Church where many years ago I used to do bell ringing oh it seems such an enormous number of years and also my dad whilst there helped organise the um, handbells and he made it easy for novices and he um, marked up sheet music in colour codedness so people could follow their parts so, so. beautiful point in the river here well there's a couple of things to show you here and I'll zoom in So on the foreground here uh, you've got a traveller's site and then behind that are some cranes now those cranes are building a hotel that will be right next to Cambridge North Station so we're sort of dead level more or less with Cambridge North Station here and on the other side of the river This is a rather nice pub called the Plough in Fenditton which is known round here for selling 
rather nice, expensive, high quality food. And it is a gorgeous place to eat your lunch down here by the river camp. So here is a bridge over the river. This bridge is carrying the very busy A14. And the word Newnham there, that is the name of one of the colleges in Cambridge. So that particular piece of graffiti slash street art slash whatever you want to call it, public art, I'm guessing was put there by a student. So here we are underneath the bridge uh, carrying A14 and there's a lot of um, street art graffiti down here that I can show you. So, um, I'll shoot a bit more when I've got to another point of interest. So to my right, you've got the, the beauty of the River Cam, gorgeous, just slowly flowing away. And then suddenly I came across to my left, this burnt out car. Not something I expected to find at all, but there it is. Well, on my left here are some some interesting and important riverside signs and I noticed at the bottom there was a protest notice by locals who did not want that bridge that is now being built to be built and to my right reach the final point before I turn around on this bike ride and that is Bates Bike Lock so this is Bates Bike Lock and the weir over there this was originally uh, the lock keepers cottage but now judging on the sign just there Here's someone's uh, photographic studio, so I'll give you a little walk around the area. Views up here are absolutely gorgeous.
So here's the weir. And back over to my right there, just point the camera in that direction, is that E14 bridge. So what I'm going to do is change lens on this camera now to my telephoto and we'll finish this video underneath that bridge and zoom over to show you the other street art there. Now as it happens I took some photographs of the graffiti on the other side of the river and I'll put a link to those photographs in the description of this video but I forgot to shoot any more video there so I thought we'll end this video back here at the beginning of the bike ride in Chesterton.